Let's run corner again, White. Corner again. Let's get the tape. Kevin UMaine basketball out. coach Bob Walsh has struggled in his first year with the team, but thinks his team is heading in the right direction. The, the product, the results aren't where we want them to be right now. We do feel like we're making progress with the mentality that we're trying to establish. Bob Wallace turned Rhode Island College into a D3 powerhouse. He looks to do the same with his struggling UMaine basketball team. Both coaching jobs have their similarities. Area where basketball is really important, uh, a state school. Uh, basketball kind of takes over in Rhode Island in the winter as it can in Maine as well. Um, not a lot of success, you know, kind of building a, a new culture and a foundation from the beginning, focusing on the process. So, uh, yeah, there are a lot of similarities, and it's one of the reasons why I felt like it was a really good fit for myself. Unlike Walsh's success at Rhode Island College, where he went to nine straight D3 tournaments, his UMaine team hasn't done so well with just one win in its first 15 games. But Walsh still believes in his program. You know, it hasn't been uh, straight line progress. It's been a little bit up and down. We've been inconsistent. Uh, we've got to get a lot better, but we've got a really good group of kids, and we feel like we're putting the foundation in place for a championship program, and that's what we want to do. Between public relations, recruiting, and coaching, Walsh has a lot on his plate. But he says the hard work is fun and credits his staff for helping him. Exciting. It's nonstop. You know, there are very few days where you wake up and you don't have a lot to do, but I'm lucky. We have a great uh, support staff. Our basketball staff is terrific. I've got good young coaches. Uh, the recruiting aspect is really important. Uh, the day-to-day -day connection, uh, getting our program sort of out into the community is really important. And getting in the gym with our guys, the individual development and the team development. So it's a lot of stuff. We're enjoying it. It's a lot of fun.